Hey guys, it's Chelsea K. right here and welcome back to my channel, a place where I give young adults and college students tips and tricks on how to find their passion, build their brand and get that break. And in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the tips that I use, the steps that I take to prepare for a 4.0 or a hot girl semester in college. So without further ado, let's just get right into the video. junior in college I am not new to this I'm true to these jokes but I have learned a lot of stuff a lot of tips and found out what works and what doesn't really work for me at least I found that when I really take certain steps to prepare for a great like semester and to calm my mind and really organize myself for the semester the semester usually goes really good so the first thing that I usually do is get my schedule together you know after you pick all your classes and i plug my entire life into google calendar i plug my work hours i plug my school hours i try to plug whatever extracurricular or student organization meetings that i may have throughout the week i even schedule study time what i realized that this does is really kind of declutter my mind so going forward i knew i already had like a game plan going into the semester so i don't have to figure out what to do along the way i'll already have it in my google calendar and bonus tip it's already in your phone link all of your emails and all your google calendars to your phone calendars so that you just have it there so you'll never miss a class never miss an assignment on blackboard never miss anything because it will all be right there at your fingertips on your phone the next thing i do to prepare for a great 4.0 semester is clear up my workspace trust me your physical space has a lot to do with how your mental space is and i cannot operate in clutter or dirt and to be completely honest that's how my study space and my room like my apartment started to look you know <laughs> at the end of last semester going into winter break so i made it a point of duty clean my room um really really clean it not just tidy but clean my room and switch up my study space which i am really loving so i have my bed in a different space and my desk is in a different space and it just kind of made it feel new and different just like the the semester so I, I want to carry new things into the new semester so i cleared up my study space and cleaned everywhere and then i cleaned off and revamped my calendars so i also have physical calendars i have a monthly physical calendar that i see that's right on my desk and then i have a whiteboard which is where i write my weekly to-do list so i have a planner that i write my to-do list in and i have a weekly whiteboard planner so i cannot miss them the next thing i do is prep my planner and i have a, a planner that i use guys it's actually a product that one of my best friends and i launched shante it's called the young and thriving planner it basically has like everything you need to know to thrive in college as you know a young adult and a college student so i prep my planner so i put all my classes in my planner um all the grades for it so i, I take the syllabus and look through it to see what assignments I'll have. And then I just plug those into my planner. I also have like my semester goals and I just kind of write down all of the responsibilities that I'll have for this semester. So if it's, I write down my classes. So I'm taking like two math classes and two engineering classes um, and a, like a writing class so i wrote those down and then i wrote my <laughs> extracurricular activities and responsibilities so a part of a scholarship that i i get yearly requires me to have like community service um for about twice a month so i have that down in there and then i'm gonna be the student president <laughs> um i'm going to be the student body president so i have those responsibilities written down in there so everything that i will possibly need to do is written down in that planner and i just have it there written down and it kind of releases me because i know that i won't forget about anything and i'll have my planner 
to keep me accountable. I also ensure that when I am prepping my planner and my semester goals are set, I ensure that all areas of my life is covered in those semester goals. So I have goals for my businesses. I have goals for my physical health. I have goals for my mental health. I have goals just in general and sometimes those can get carried away when you're at college busting your brain and busting your, your butt to you know do that work and be involved on campus so make sure that whatever goals you have they're not only school centered and the young and thriving planner really really helps me to just keep organized and ensure that i'm not forgetting any so of one of the last things that i usually do when planning to have our 4.0 semester is plan my budget i don't know about you but i have to pay my own rent my own tuition my own everything so i have to keep track of my funds and my money and that includes finding scholarships you guys know if you don't know i'm the scholarship queen like i am just obsessed with searching and applying for scholarships to ensure that you know i have the funds to pay for my tuition so with that it can get a bit overwhelming so i usually just kind of have it spread out again for the semester and kind of have like a plan so i believe my plan for this semester is to get like 10k in scholarships to clear up um that tuition balance that i have and that can sound daunting but again plugging the young and thriving planner i can use it to break down my monthly goals to say okay i need to apply for three scholarships that will equal this amount this month and then that helps me to not to not forget about it and to keep on track and not to get overwhelmed because it can get overwhelming at, at times so apart from scholarships i'm paying for school i also have to eat you know sleep and live so I also keep track of like my major expenses and the income that I have coming in. So whether it's from internships, on-campus jobs, everything that I could possibly earn, I'll put it in my, my planner under the expenses and the income section so that I can just keep track of what I'm spending or how I need to spend my money to ensure that I am not overspending on anything and that all of my bills are paid rough just think about it and like have an idea of what your finances will look like for the next semester so apart from like prepping my planner and writing down my finances while all of that can be really good in giving you peace of mind you want to connect with like a higher source or just put yourself in a state to visualize and reflect on the past semester and just gear yourself up, pump yourself up for the next semester. So my last tip guys is to pray if you're religious. So I'm Christian, so I'll pray, I'll ask God for wisdom, I'll ask him for the strength, ooh, the strength to withstand all the courses and just apply myself the best way. I just ask him to really just take the reins um, and help me throughout this semester because it can get hard and uh, I want to just be grounded in him and remember that I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. So if you're religious, then you pray. If you're not religious, then I suggest journaling. Journaling is a really good way to kind of like set your intentions um, and when you are going through a rough patch in the semester, you can always flip back to your journal and just, you know, think about how you were feeling that day and really use it to motivate yourself. So what I usually do, because I pray and I journal as well, so I would say, you know, I can do this going into the semester i have everything that i need to be successful i've done it before so i can do it again you know things like that to really hold me so i can flip back and look at it when the semester gets rough which is usually about midterm and then again going into final okay, so that is it for the video feel free to check the link in my bio to check out the young and thriving planner ah, i can't believe it it's it's amazing guys like you will not like regret purchasing one of these for a planner and it's specifically made for college students by college students you'll not you'll not regret it so link is in my bio to pre-order yours today join the fam and just get ready to crush that semester period so if you like this video give it a thumbs up remember to subscribe and stay tuned for more videos Bye, guys.